The shop is open! It's open! So welcome to my shop! And then we add a sprinkle of gold stars. <laughs> Looks taller than you! It is on well, a desk, but... On a desk, but yes. <laughs> Barney and I just wanted to say how proud of you we are. <laughs> Dave, show up my nose. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. I want you to be able to smell them really well. So it is eight minutes to go. Seven minutes to go. <laughs> Congratulations on launching your store. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe I'm saying this, but we are officially launched. Well, I say we, it's your, <laughs> it's your baby, it's your shop. Um, I just, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I just wanted to, to take a minute to just say how freaking proud I am and stoked for you I am. <laughs> um, like honestly, um, you have no idea like the amount of work and effort and thought that's gone into this. Um, every spare second when Barney's been in bed, before Barney gets up, um, literally it's just been... And like, we were what? talking about this the other day, the, the oh. amount of steps you. and like all the things, <laughs> it's just, it blows my mind. It's been so fun, I have loved it, but it's been hard. The yeah. hardest thing is when you think you figured it out and then you get like a sample back and it's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> and then you have just to... totally different from and what you And then it's just back to like the starting point all over again. Yeah. That was it was that kind of disappointment that was the hardest thing is when you just don't know what the next step is. Yeah. But, but you figured it out. Yeah. And I honestly think what's what's absolutely mad is that some of the things when they started off are nothing like no. what they ended up. So many things have gone. Yeah. <laughs> they never they never saw the light. Today. And I just think <laughs> that you um you couldn't have improved. How are you doing? I think everything that that is on the site uh, that is like in the shop is just the absolute best that it can be. And I couldn't be more proud of you. So Thank you. We love you mum. We're so proud. Happy lunch day Okay it's a few hours later. Apologies for the mattress and um, we're just letting it air because it's, uh, it's a new mattress um right so we've been open for a couple of hours i've had over a hundred orders which just blows my mind so thank you so much if you are one of the first people to order um i have been um very preoccupied with trying to get the website ready and the stock all organized and inventory and spreadsheets and just all the things that you kind of have to do with with launching a, a shop um, and I'll be honest what I'm craving more than anything is just to go and give Barney his bath and put him to bed because for the last two days I've really not spent hardly any time with him so yeah that's just kind of what what I'm craving right now is just to to go back to being a mum for a little bit and then tomorrow I'm going to get packing all of the orders which I'm so excited about um I'm just in shock I'm honestly in shock I can't believe it's real I can't believe the website's working I just yeah, this has been almost a year in the making and it probably doesn't look like a lot but I promise you there's been so much to do and so many, just so many things that were wrong and so many dead ends and just, I'm just so proud of myself and I very, very, very rarely say that but I am, I, I got hit by myself, I've had, you know, there's been no team or no help or anything, I've done it myself so yeah, I'm just... I'm ready just to go and put Barney to bed and just decompress. I feel like a little bit, you know, like a little bit antsy, like a bit shaky. <laughs> Before I go to bed, I just wanted to show you our diaries. Um, we bought these from Papier, Papier or Papier, I'm not sure. Um, I bought mine first and then Dave wanted the same one. So it says my name, which is obviously Sophie Brown. And then it says a year of magic, um, which is very exciting. Um, which we just got personalised because I feel like it is going to be a year of magic with the shop and going back to Disney World and we just have some big plans for, you know, a magical year. <laughs> so I got the pink one and then Dave got the, like, the tealy, bluey, green one. So that's really exciting um, just to have some, like, nice new diaries. Um, oh, we just got another order. Oh my goodness. 
Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go and put Barney to bed and just decompress and then come back fresh in the morning and start packing orders, which should be really good fun. Um, I've been waiting for that moment for many, many, many months. So I will see you in the morning and we will pack some orders. Good morning. <laughs> good morning. We're gonna pack some orders today. I thought I'd give you a quick tour of my kind of storage um, shop setup and then we're gonna pack some orders. Okay, so this is it. <laughs> it's not the most <laughs> exciting or huge setup. So up here I have thank you cards um, and then stickers. I need to figure out how to get stickers on a roll because this is obviously not the best way to do it. And then I've got some of these envelopes. So yeah, this top drawer is a bit of a, just a mismatch of stuff. We've got our um, diaries, a pen, the gold stars for the orders, some more tape. These are just some more thank you cards. And then I've got some like filming equipment um, back there. And then this is where I'm keeping prints. So we've got Keep Dreaming and Welcome Home. And because um, everything is gold foiled, I've got them in these like protective wallets and then this one is magic maker and um the little house prints which is sold out so quick that's now gone and then when i get more stock i'll continue to fill these but i've got plastic wallets in there and um, some cardboard boxes in here that i've already made up and then the bottom one i think is just paperwork so yeah it's not the most extravagant um set up going but it's it's a good place to start and then I've got my desk here which I painted pink um and that's where I'm going to pack orders so it's quite good because everything's kind of behind me and then the desk is just here in front of me and then tea just magically appears through the door <laughs> where are you <laughs> I was trying to just be a a floating a head, hand a headless hand and Dave always brings a Disney cup of course he knows. We what? don't really have many. <laughs> no, we that? really don't. We're on Cinderella. Thank right. you, Dave. You're welcome. To be honest, I don't think that's a good idea. I need to, I think I need to get myself a nice coaster and then just get into the habit of maybe putting my tea maybe just here. Yeah. I mean, what an aesthetic. <laughs> Okay, let's pack an order. Here is a box I made earlier. <laughs> you buy these flat and then you just build them by like folding all the edges over. Um, they're quite easy to build once you get the hang of it. So this order is for a Keep Dreaming print and a Welcome Home print and a Keep Dreaming tote bag. Um, I can't wait for you to feel how beautiful these are. It was really important to me that these were made in England. Um, I just really wanted to support like British textiles um, and they're just beautiful. And then if you didn't know, I've got this magic power where I just create like pink paper <laughs> out of nowhere. So you'll never know where this came from. <laughs> I feel like I'm probably being a bit overzealous with it, but you know, that's all right. I'm sure I'm gonna get better at this, but I just kind of <laughs> want it to surround the bag. And then we add a sprinkle of gold stars, <laughs> because why not? And then because I've got the thank you cards right here, it just means I'm not going to forget. So I pop a thank you card there and that's it, good to go let me know if you think you got this one so then these just fold into here like this and then they're not secure enough to send so then i just tape down um all the sides basically oh gosh my tape's just run out oh no well this is exciting a brand new tape i feel like the brown kind of hid a lot of you know like anything like this because it was brown on brown so we'll see how the pink looks how do you do this thing oh like that um in perfect lines right let's just go for it i promise i'm normally really quite neat with this but i think because you're watching me i'm just gonna 
like end up messing it up. Also, if anyone does have any tips, please do leave them in the comment section because this is all brand new to me. I've never done this before. So, yeah, I can already tell the pink looks messy, like the brown, the brown just blended in so well. It doesn't look bad and I do like the pink but yeah it definitely shows like the messiness um, a little bit more but you can't do it like absolutely perfect because there's like a ridge here um, and it would just take hours to get it looking like absolutely perfect but I think it's it's good enough. I'm not going to print out the address but we just have one of these like thermal label printers um, so I'll just do like a plain one that I'll stick the address over the top um, So what I'm doing is just popping the address on like that I would like to get the click and click and whatever it's called system soon but I just need to invest in a um, bigger printer to be able to do that and then I'm just going to grab a sticker and then I just pop them like that on the address but Maybe I'll stick it there because <laughs> I need to stick an actual address over the top. So there we go, that's what they're looking like so far. I'm sure I'm gonna get a better, more efficient, neater system as time goes on, but I think they look really pretty and if you order one, I hope you think that as well. Um, so yeah, I have many, many, many hours left in this room. I'm gonna try and figure out what I want to watch. I might watch Stranger Things from the beginning because I've seen it and isn't season coming out in the spring so I could just have like all the other seasons on in the background I think that could be nice so yeah <laughs> um I just wanted to give you something that you've definitely not seen before and I'm sure it'll be a massive what surprise Barney and I just wanted to say how <laughs> proud of you we are Thanks, Dave show them up my nose <laughs> yeah you're welcome I want you to be able to smell them really well <laughs> pink tulips are my favorite thank you Dave you're very welcome oh I love them we love you Good morning. Look what I woke up to this morning. I think building the boxes is the hardest part because <laughs> packing them is so much fun but building them is not so much and Dave did all of these. Thank you Dave. Look at all of those. Someone has been a very busy worker bee. This is really heavy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. I am so proud of you. Thank you so much if you've ordered anything. I just, this is, I mean. Looks taller than you. It is on well, a desk, but. On a desk, but yes. Looks so good. <laughs> so we're currently trying to get a thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> I think we got one. Yeah, I like this. This might be one of my favorite thumbnails I've ever done. Oh my God, right. No more messing. Post office. I'm going. Hmm. <laughs> Shall we have a PJ packing party? <laughs> One, two, three! <laughs> <laughs> Say thank you for watching! Thank you for watching! The shop is open! It's open! We're so proud of you, Mummy! <laughs> thank you. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Right. <laughs> um, see you in the next one. See you in the next one. Bye. 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 Wave. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>